Hey, what is up, you guys? So today we got some Pikmin. Uh, I believe there were two, if not three, of these games. And quite a small sort of cult following from what I heard at the time. And I know... What's his name? Olimar or something got added to Super Smash Bros. at some point. Don't think I ever tried playing as him, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, let's 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 give it a go. A Pikmin save file has been created. Okay. Ship's log. So from what little I know, you you pull these Pikmin things out of the ground because we crash land on a planet and we need them to help us fix our ship. But there is some sort of time limit. So let's see what happens. He got a big nose. Oh dear, looks like we're a uh, yeah, collision course, I thought so. Is it Earth? Olimar, no! The impact site, okay. Interesting. Looks like a bomb. Whoa, got messed up. My name is Captain Olimar. While traveling through space, my ship was struck by a meteor. I must have blacked out, and I awoke on the surface of a weird planet. With so many parts lost, the skeletal hull of my beloved dolphin is a painful sight. The engine is gone. I'm stranded. To make matters worse, my atmospheric sensors indicate this planet's environment contains high level of poisonous oxygen. My life support systems can function for only 30 days. If I can't repair the dolphin by then, no, better not to think about it. I must find the missing ship parts. Okay, so we've only got 30 days, eh? Right, so we got a punch. Whatever that is. Okay. I have recovered zero. So we got ah, uh, so a par today on average or whatever. Okay, let's see what we can find. Hmm. Right, what's this? What the hell? Whoa! Good old Nintendo. Is that our first Pikmin? A strange thing has appeared before me. I had barely begun my search when it reared up as if it were waiting for me. It then dropped a single seed. What is it? Is it alive? Is it a machine? It resembles a vegetable on my home planet that we call an onion. I should call this an onion too! think we got it. The seed that the onion dropped took root of the soil and has now produced an adorable little sprout. This sprout emits a strange light and it sways back and forth without benefit of wind. I cannot help but think it is calling to me. I am compelled. I must approach it and press A. Got it. Whoa. I wonder if the red one's explosive or... Because I know they're all different colours, like blue and stuff. Extraordinary! When I plucked the sprout, it turned out to be a living creature, not a plant. Picking it has done no visible damage. It just stands there, staring at me. Its shape is similar to the Pick Pick brand carrots I love so much. I believe I shall call it a Pikmin. Cool, so we're like an alien exploring a planet. Here I am, stranded on a toxic planet, fighting to survive, and yet I'm intrigued. 
I must research this fascinating creature. I shall try and grab it and throw it with A, and I'll call it to my side with B. Hmm, perhaps it will react to C and X as well. Following controls appear to allow me to A, yeah, yeah. I must survive! I need to familiarise myself with these controls and my surroundings! Cool, come on, dude. Cool, it makes noises with the C stick. Beep beep. Come on, lad. Hmm. Cool, another cutscene, that's helpful. What does this Pikmin think of me? I must observe its reactions. The more things I try, the more reactions I can catalogue. I shall attempt to grab and throw it with a... Ah, uh, okay. Cool. Right, come here. Come on, pick it up. Oh, come on. Weird. Yeah, maybe zooming will help. Ugh. Weird controls. Ah, okay. So now we can throw him, I think. Oh, damn it. Come on. So where do we want to chuck him? No idea. Right, come on, lad. Hey. Aha! Right, let's try chucking him here. Cool, okay. And then get that. What is that? Ah, is that a part for the ship? I think I see how this game works now, okay. Wait, that's not my ship. Ah, then we can get these two here. Okay, cool. Oh, that thing for the bag. We must need ten tokens to lift the barricade. Astonishing, the onion has sown more seeds. The small red pellet the Pikmin harvested after cutting down a flower it appears to be some type of food that can propagate more Pikmin. The onion seems to be a sort of incubator. Needless to say, I must study this strange life form more. So we've got two now, yeah? Put red Pikmin in. E no. And then get him. Nice! Ah, you just have to walk by them and they start fights. That's cool. Cool, cool, cool. Come on, lads. There we are. What's he doing? Come on. Wake up, lad. Kill him. Right, lads, bring this back to base now. Hey, good lads. So how many have we got now? Oops. Damn. Cool. We all together now, lads? Nice. Pull him up. And then one more, I think. And we got seven. Excellent. Right, now where was that thing which needed five? Here we are. 
Right, boys, get to work. Good lads. On the double. Man, I really like this game so far. It's got quite a nice charm to it. Good lad. Up two, up two. I assume it's quicker if you go over the number needed. Oh, yo. Good stuff. Now I need you to all sprout. Excellent. So, yeah, I wonder if it matters if we have different coloured ones or not. I think that's all of us, right? Cool. So there was something up here I wanted to check. I think I saw you only need one, but still. Right, here we are, boys. E. And then the rest of you come here. Come on, boys, wake up. There we are. Whoa, they legged it. And I think that's everything for this tiny area. I may be wrong. Alright, just wait for them to bloom. And I think that's all of us. E. Excellent. Ah, so that confusion before, I think I was telling one of them to lift this box or whatever they do. Which is why he just wasn't doing anything, because he was too weak. Nice. Ah, we've got a few more tokens as well. Get those immediately, I think. Pikmin are as curious as children. They form groups to perform tasks that would be impossible for an individual. The glimmer of hope has begun to shine in my heart. If I can make use of their skills, perhaps I can fix my ship. I shall sum up all I've learned of Pikmin conduct. Approach and press A to pick sprouts. Yeah. Grab, throw, B to call, X to dismiss, right, okay. C to command a group, nice. Cool. Uh, where are you? Where are you all, lads? Hello. There you are. What is this? Is that a part? Amazing. There's no mistaking it. My ship's engine rests before my very eyes. By a stroke of pure luck. I have already stumbled upon the most important piece of my damaged craft. Fate has smiled upon me, but how will I get it back to the dolphin? Right, lads, get this back. Good boys. And then you lot wake up. Come on. Come on. Oh, yes. Right, boys. And then I will need a few of you. Good, 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 good. Any more for any more? One up here, okay. Is he taking it? Good lad. Right, and you lot gonna need you. Right, chaps, get this. Excellent. So that's this area cleared out as well. And then we'll get them to grab the engine and see what this nice upgrade is. I wonder when, uh, I assume they'll start introducing enemies and stuff at points so you can't freely do this stuff. wonder how long the day and night cycle is as well if they have one. When many Pikmin seeds sprout at once, I find it rather tedious to pluck them out individually. 
My wife always told me I was no good at routine tasks. I guess I'll try and get it all done at once by repeatedly tapping A. Okay. I've noticed that when I add Pikmin to my group, they become filled with excitement and flush of bright colour. At other times, they revert to a paler hue and give off a dim glow. Paying close attention to these differences is bound to help me distinguish between Pikmin. Okay. Nice, get the mash on, baby. Oops. How many we got? 25! Whoa! We got some new ones here, I think. Once they sprout up. That's really cool that you can just mash when this loads. Last one, I think. Hey, right. We've got no blueies yet, but let's go. Right, chaps. Lift this engine. Go, cool, boys. All of you. Hey! Hup two, hup two. Do not stick it in the onion! Bring it to my ship! Go on, lads! Mate, yeah, I can see why this game's got a cult following. So I assume, I haven't heard how this game ends, but I assume, you know, if there is a good and bad ending, we make it off the planet. But I wonder what happens in Pikmin 2, and I think there was a third, so it'll be interesting to see how this game develops over time. Go on boys, nearly there! Ooh yes! Boing! Got the engine, that's a very good start. Wonder what upgrade this will give us. Oh glorious, with the help of these Pikmin I've taken a huge step back towards home. My ship can once again lift off. The glimmer of hope is beginning to burn more brightly. But what has become of the remaining parts? That search starts tomorrow. I wonder do Pikmin sleep? Ah, back in the onion at the end of the day. Okay. They're so helpful! Oh damn, are we leaving already? They're following! One day since impact. I have somehow managed to launch the dolphin. But I was surprised to see the onion lift off with me. Perhaps the Pikmin cannot survive overnight on the planet's surface. Or have they merely decided to join me for other reasons? Either way, it seems they will help me again tomorrow. Yes, the dolphin is missing 29 parts. If I can't recover them all, I may never return home to my family on planet Hoko Tate. Analysis shows life support systems will function for only 29 more days. How can I repair my dolphin in such a short time? A dense forest is visible on the surface below. As it holds the keys to my survival, I name it the Forest of Hope. I explore it tomorrow. That is awesome. And we got 25! I'd imagine that's 100% for this area, unless I've missed any secrets. We will get a save on. Because you never know, we may revisit this uh, down the line. I've really enjoyed it. That is awesome! Right then guys, I have loved this one-off. If you do want to see some more, let me know. But uh, yeah, next week you'll be seeing a different game, as always. And, and again, as always, take care, stay safe, much love. Cheers for watching.